Good afternoon. Good afternoon. How are the children to do today? Good. Boy, y'all are trifling dumb. <laughs> there ain't been a nothing right there for me yet, y'all. Where we the dead? I don't want to say no way under the dead now. I don't know where we the dead. Where this you? Where this spot we did, Bob? Congo Square. Square. Stop with that. Y'all ain't know that no Congo Square or trifling now. All right. <laughs> How are the children to do this afternoon? Okay, act like I'm free. Cause see this your place, we gonna make one circle. One circle. Come down. Come over. Let him get in one circle. Too much a line at him. That will be broke up with people. Come on, square. Then it's your place. But one circle of the African got together. They like for Trump on the paper now. And say, come on, square. Then it's your place where legalized, sanctioned drum sounding. Gotta go on. They have a walk with it. Body drum. Teeth the drum. For an African. Now, how many of you this your fiddle? Now, play the fiddle. Now, see, when that teeth the African drum from, it give you all the rest of the thing like a daddy. Because it said, this your thing. Better than that, it did. But if it's somebody else's culture, who been a play them like they been a play them. So, even when the fiddle be get one way, change up everything again. Now, see, this your day. We did you. But change up everything here. Yeah. Cause some of we people still not there in the islands. Who be there for now? Some of the children were the there. Now got the elders no more. Elders done cross over. The elders done come ancestors. So they ain't got them for go to big mama and daddy, them and grind and you want to pull on them and let them for crack your teeth with honor. For honor to know how to get your sense. So honor can know when you're deep on hollow the ground. Deep on sacred ground. Plan that people are kind of this just Sunday thing. We're going on. Yeah. And yelling the drumming. But it thinks that these are musicians and entertainers. Then I think of honor the care, the spirit of we ancestors. Then I think of honor the way we ancestors been to do too. They would think they been to entertain too. But they ain't been no. They been to let the spirit go upon you. This year, here, 200 years after Charles believed the chiller along the Mississippi, then up the river road, right on through you. The biggest uprising will ever be take place. We had to, in 1811, led this yeah, uprising yeah, yeah. right to you. From the great Congo Square, lead them up. And the people join them. So we used to say the Congo Square committee say, Queen, we got did it. We well, wanted to get there. When Brother Baba Luta say, we got did it. We well, wanted to get there. The drum go beat on the sound. We gotta yell at the drum and trim me. We gotta yell at the drum all the way back, you know. But we better come across ten. We driving this morning. But we know the way we clear. They been a study with them thing. They call other thing we do witchcraft. But meteorologists, what that is? Okay. The meteorologists uh, think, say, they can predict what God gonna do. Right. Ain't no such a thing. Right. So according to their prediction, it's supposed to be raining now. I saw the cloud. I stood there and I said, okay, thank you, God. But it's your overcast. But please, you pull back the rain. We want the rain for holding back because we done poured in like Bishop. And like Bishop been pouring out the sky last week, down not you? They been pouring out the sky. When we been a kind on the road, we see them wet up and things like that. They been cleansed the way. For we the African children, the daddy, the day. For all the hundred one and but know who we the. And the queen queen, head upon the body of the Gullah Kitchen Nation. For her to see that flag yonder. You see that tree with the in the middle of. That a human body and thing tied together. African people tied together. Hunter, what did y'all? If her say, big daddy mama that go out this your soul, right here in New Orleans, right here in Louisiana, right here, well honey need for go back underneath that soul and going back and you the know say root come from the sea islands and for that the motherland. Plenty of honey ancestors did you cause they first stop in Sullivan Island where over forty percent of all African enslaved in North America come true. The African young beat the drum in 1811. Tell them come together. 
11 years later, in 1822, the African Denmark VC with Gullah Jack, beat the drum in Charleston, South Kakalaki, with Sullivan Island, the DI, and it said, come together. And then, July 2nd of that year, or when they hung Denmark VC for having vision and for taking the people and making the people the tabernacle, not just inside the church building, and make sure they have freedom in their hearts. So, when I've been a study book, what we want? Can. What we gonna shout? What we gonna rush? God said we the walk about freedom. Freedom to what? Your ancestors birth into each one of us. Cause if your ancestors ain't but strong people, who know what they are now? Then they go on dead with no seed left. But all of we that is seed of somebody, and somebody for them, 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 and somebody for them. And what way they come into this land? Where the Easter? Somebody point me to the east. Over ya. Any? East? Which way? This way? Yeah. Over ya? Yeah. You sure? Oh yeah. Cause some hand look like it going like that. Oh, yeah. Right there, Annie? Yeah. That is east. Yeah. So if east there, there, where west there? Yeah. Over ya. So where north there? Yeah. And where south there? Yeah. Anybody know this where I've been a pool of water? Yeah. We in the Gullah Geechee Nation come together to do libation. Plus, we gather the one circle and we join hand. So everybody join hand. The Lord said, when I got fan, you got water, you got camera, put them all with. Join hand with your brothers and sisters, with your family and things like that. See that what been going on too long. The people tell you, for don't touch one another. Like I see some other man uh, look around the tribe and see if you can get two of them on each side of you. Ain't nothing hurt you for having man hold your hand. If you did in the motherland, you see man dressed in pink and a whole hand to walk down Duck Road and ain't nothing else going on. They going home to your wife. They ain't going home together. You understand? But we get young and we get distracted. Prime example. And I'm a computer scientist and mathematician, so do not think that I don't know about technology. I know it in, and I know it out. Mm -hmm. And I got scholarship offers to every Ivy League you could probably think of, and I turned them down, except for Columbia. Uh. And I went to something y'all should be familiar with, a Jesuit institution yeah. as well. But the institution didn't make me. God did. Right. Mm -hmm. So God gave me mother with and taught me that those things that we create or to distract from the spirit because we don't thank God for the ability to even create them. So they become tools of our own destruction that we think we can't turn off the phone. Who's so important that in the middle of a spiritual sacred ceremony for healing, you need to hear from Because if they're dying, you ain't the doctor, they don't need to call you. <laughs> and if you are a doctor, there's another doctor on call. They can call that one. Because the ultimate doctor has to be in the mix at all times. If we want this city to heal, if we want our children to stop killing one another, because they don't know who they are, that they could walk through here, but they don't let them because they lock this place. They lock this place not for no reason. There's a spiritual reason that when the water flooded this city, this was still here. There's a spiritual reason that other folks know that we ignore when they start locking us off from places. Because when the gate is open, the power from inside flows out freely. That's the same thing with your heart. If you lock it off, distract it, gate it off, ain't nothing positive can get in there. Because there ain't no time for the pulse to match the energy of the universe. The ultimate drum you were birthed with is right here. So when we say the drum, the Gwine, Congo Square, Gullah Geechee, the we, the drum, the Gwine, Congo Square, for the last year, the cicadas are singing now. That they know we're going to come here. I ain't care if the gate be locked. I ain't care if the gate be open. We minister information now the car, the town, all I said to her was did a word, study me, but some city telling me, but some kind of thing for fill out, but see, I have to fill out a paper. I have to fill out a paper for what supposed to be a public park where we ancestors have been a day in any week. 
Uh -huh. I didn't pull out no paper. Uh -uh. I said, I tell you what, let the gate be locked when we get there. By the time we finish shouting and rushing and pulling, right, I bet right. you it won't be. Uh -huh. <laughs> we done seen it before. But now the gate on your spirit, I can't do nothing more with. Right. But pray for you. But as we all join hands today and make one circle and may the circle be unbroken here and after. Because I see so many people, so many people representing millions. The black Seminoles, the Kushite Moors, the Gullah Geechees, the Creole, all of we, the children of the motherland, the Syrians, Comedic, black Seminole, all of we the Diddy, Rastafari, Yoruba, all of we the one, and more the family to come. Come into the circle family. We ain't gonna start without you. You see the drum coming. And more and more the drum coming. Think about 1811. Think of how it started. Think of how when the first drummers got here today. And my brother had the key. Baba Luther. When Baba Luther opened up this today. He was here. And then the sisters came. The brothers came. And you see the more are coming. It is about what we do that draws the energy. And it's about what we do that repels our family. So we make the choice. That's what free will is. Honey can be free till honey fool. Or honey can know about freedom. Freedom been a choice. Freedom still a choice. So we not let other rest of people say they can take them from me. And honey not free, honey give away honey freedom. So this your day. God sent me up to help you reclaim that. But hold upon your culture. Hold upon maybe the people that look at honey like you're cracking down you. Because when we in the crack, we teach so and thing like that for a long time. They've been saying, then the cracking people did from the island thing. What I need for stay off and run. <laughs> so don't think that we didn't hear that here in Louisiana. Y'all ain't tricked the Geeches, right? That y'all thought the Geeches was some obscure set of people. Even though y'all use a bunch of our words in y'all everyday conversation. <laughs> and y'all eating gumbo with a color word anyway for okra. Y'all do all that. But y'all want to treat me geeches right now. I store in on y'all. I tell the truth. Okay, I know so. Yeah. <laughs> I know so. Y'all be look for people look like a me and say, great God, that dark geechy there. Call him geechy with all kind of thing. But maybe you didn't know. Geechee comes from Gizi, G-I-D-Z-I, -I, and from the ethnic group Kizi, K-I-S-S-E. That is where that word comes from. Gullah comes from Angolans because the Angolans were the first of the Africans kidnapped, captured, and brought into the Sea Islands from Al Kebulan, which we now call Africa today. Uh -huh. The corruption of their name was when they were sold on the auction block and then began to be called Gullah. At Sullivan's Island, they were penned in, very similar to the West Bank and Algiers, where they held our people to season you, to break you, before they brought you to the main auction block in the city of New Orleans, or the city of Charleston, South Cackalack. They wanted you to either be weakened through starvation till you bow, or they beat you until you would submit. But plenty of we people play food for catch smart. They act like they've been unbroke down. But the spirits still been standing up. And they wait till the right moment. And they come together. A gully get your man. I ain't call a man named Kato. Led the Storm Rebellion in 1739. The same way Charles led the 1811. Other people call him slave revolt. I call it uprising. And we are here still rising up today. And we thank God that we to rise up and know. So we answer sir, is to pray for their clean. This is go on seeking in the wilderness and think like a lady. But save the spirit, but know what to do. But take care of family, but hold them up, but hold them together. And so that's your family, that member, and catch your sense. And so the we answer to them, but pray to the east. Before, and we say, Ashe. Now in the church, 
You say amen. Same thing. And so it is. So much of crackiness with y'all know. Y'all speak like this, so if you don't hear a word that comes from English, you always think it's something else. We won't say what y'all think. But that's all it means. You agree, and so it is. What you speak is what you will have. You speak things into existence. So y'all gonna stop calling your children and your children's children and your neighbors them other words. Some that start with N. Because when they become that definition of a lazy, shiftless individual, it's your business. Because you called them that. So they acted accordingly. If you want a big chief, you want a queen, I understand out the womb you name them. That. And that is what they become. Because every time they hear their name, something in their spirit stands up. And by the same token, if I call you a slave all day, which says you are an item, you have no sense, you have no culture, you have no language, you have no spirituality, you have no ethnicity, you have nothing more than what I give you, you become to act according to that too, that you move not until someone says move. When we pour now to the West for them who come here this your way, who had a good sense for no better than the answer to the word slave? Because God ain't make them that. God make them people. All the rest of people try to make them three fifths of who God made them for people. And so, but we ancestors, who now we to call Seminole, Black Seminole, Red Stick, Geeky, all of this, will come west. We pour and we sing. So now, some hundred children with the out to the day, going north for a little while. You go on north when the elders would say, go on your own and get a good job. Go on your own and get some education. Go on your own and get out your, this your city. Go on your own and get out this your country. Because this ain't nothing for you, y'all. Ain't it? Y'all ain't yet it, eh? We yet it, too. They used to pay some of us to leave the state of South Carolina and go get an education elsewhere. If you said you were going to be a lawyer, a doctor, forget about a computer scientist and mathematician like me. They hurried up and wanted to get you out of there. Because they thought if you left, you'd never come back. But for all them, who be gone not. But in more we have to come back home. We poor and we sit. I sit. I sit. And now we're one of the dead now. Where we at the day? In the South. The dirty, dirty. It ain't going with that. The dirty South. Uh, I'll let you hear me. All right. In the South. Come on, family. Come on, John. Didn't I tell y'all more are coming? More are coming. More are coming. Your heart is the drum. It play louder than these brothers and sisters could ever play. And when your heart is in tune, folks can hear from here to Africa. You hear what I'm saying? Don't think somebody else is not standing on the western seaboard of the motherland right now, pouring and signaling back with us. They feel us. That pulsation is stronger than any of these storms they can ever lay. Anything they ever build here from this day forward will be blessed to be for this community of African people, of Indian people, that whole strong to who you are down here in the south. For all of we ancestors who done cross over. For all the family who Katrina take from you. For all the family who the other rest of storms care from you. We pray for the good spirits that rise up. To fill up this your city. For going to city hall. For going in the county council. For going to Capitol Hill. For make these people for no say everybody y'all ain't healed yet. For make these people for no everybody ain't rebuilt yet. We want honor to come go this your day. Come to this your place. Come to this your space. Broke up the heart like you wanted to block up this concrete with machine. Broke up the heart soften them this your day so that they remember all of them who gone on before now. We thank you for them who know our freedom been. We thank you who last words crossing over. We thank God. We thank you for this your day that the family together together and may this your circle never be broken. And we pull and together we sing. I sing. I sing.